Yes. Don't push me. That's the whole thing. Don't push me, dude. I'm not on the right. I'm in the center. But I'm just saying, dude. Don't push me. Speaking of don't push me, here we go, dude. I just saw this. Help this woman, Doa, two A's at the end, heal from racial trauma. Now, when I read this headline, I go like this. Okay, I understand trauma is real. I suffer from PTSD. It makes my life a living hell. I am not ever really hit with racism. I'm a white guy, mostly, except for the past few years, because whites kind of took a dip. I've been living pretty good. Now, it's harder to be a white guy than ever. Who gives a fuck, man? I'm still rolling on my dolo, and it's fine, okay? But, you know, especially in Hollywood, it's tougher. So I'm not complaining. I don't give a shit. Give all the parts to all people of color. I don't care. I want, for real, there to be a movie about Buzz Aldrin and a trans woman to play him. That I want that. The biopic. Just like, one small step for... Wait a minute. How, what do we actually say? I want that movie. And one giant... Well, it's a, definitely a giant leap for... Well, we can't say mankind. I don't know anymore. Netflix just... The woke shit. So... Racial trauma, I know nothing about. So let's take a gander. I don't look at this and go, oh, for fuck's sake, I'm not a boomer. I look at this and I say, let's do some fucking actually, let's take a comb and we'll see what's going on. We'll come through this. It's a GoFundMe. A lot of the GoFundMe out there, from fummies out there are bullshit. But let's take a fine tooth comb and look on through this GoFundMe. Let's see what that was all about. I don't deal with racism. Hello, my name is Doa. I am a, now. Let's do the fucking scale here. The the don't push me scale. We start at zero. Let's start at zero, right? Above, and then as it goes, we'll see what the don't push me scale is. Okay, don't push me to the right. I'm a centrist. If you're watching on YouTube, we've got the don't push me scale, and it's my hand. We're starting at zero. If you're listening, I feel like you'll probably get the gist of what's going to be happening during this bit. All I'm asking, Doa, I get racial trauma. I don't I don't get racial trauma. I get you get it. And I'm a willing to understand that maybe you need some fucking bags for what happened. All I'm asking for is work with me. And don't give me two right wings where I'm flying around in a circle getting dizzy because I'm a centrist. Here's the scale. And we start the GoFundMe paragraph here. Hello. My name is Doa. I am a Nubian, Afro, Indigenous, interdisciplinary artist. Zero's here. I just, the too many words, okay? I don't even care about how you can be whatever. Just too many words. Punching. But it's not bad. We're at like a one or a two now. And decol decolonial practice-based researcher currently residing on the stolen stolen lands of the Okay, now this is what it says. X high W M upside down E eight K high W A Y Upside down E-M? What's a high W? Where's that W going? Hey, W, get a little bit lower and bigger. <laughs> In parentheses, musqueam, never heard of it. Probably my privilege showing. Let's pick it up with the left hand, dude. Oh, dude, hold on a second. There's another word I don't know. S-K with the underlined... Regular W, X with the underline, W, U with an accent over it. The number seven. And then the word mesh, in parentheses, squeamish, and seleli with two, in parentheses, swelly with tooth peoples, colonial known as Vancouver, dude. You can see my armpit hair. Ah! 
So now we got to start, dude, don't push me, but now we got to start back at, this is not one. This is, we're at 10, dude, because this ain't over, motherfuckers. Look, the fucking temperature burst. All right, let me just read it. It's a really diff it's re it's really difficult for me to ask for financial support. However, I have exhausted all my options and need my community's help through my healing journey. I work for a charitable arts organization and I am Oh, you know what actually? We're going down. Cuz I get it. You went up a little bit, but let's take it down, dude. Maybe the thermometer didn't break. It's really difficult for me to ask for financial support. We feel you, dude. It's a hard time, so we're getting back down. However, I have exhausted all my options. That's sad. I'm in. Uh, we're going back down. Dude, you get me back to centrist. Very good. Thank you, Doa. And need my community to help through the healing journey. Okay. We don't like the word healing journey together, but you know what? We'll go up a little bit, but we're still here. Uh, I work for a charitable arts organization. Very admirable. Let's take a dip, dude. We're getting back to one, aren't we? Getting back to zero, aren't we? Uh, and I am initiating this GoFundMe because I am currently dealing with the impacts of racial trauma. What is it? Let's hang tight right here for a second. I experienced at a work event which took place on April 7th and 8th in 2022. Now, you experienced racial trauma April 7th. Now I got my fucking detective shit on. I got my hat that go that's got the front bill and the back bill. And I'm here with a magnifying glass. Because if you experienced trauma on April 7th, what you doing going back April 8th? What you doing? All good. I don't know the issue. Let's read on. On the 7th, I faced racist and transphobic remarks from an artistic director working in one of BC's school districts. On the 8th, I witnessed a culturally appropriated performance by a local non-black hip-hop instructor who publicly humiliated me in the black community after I highlighted her lack of cultural and historical context about hip-hop. Um, where am I here? This had to be addressed as it could be harmful for the children she educates in school. She admitted that her dance school does not have a single black instructor because they lack the 10 years of experience she's looking for. My employer took no action with either the transphobic edu educator or the dance instructor. Not even an email of acknowledgement was uh, of acknowledgement was sent to the colleagues in support of the only black employee. I had a mental breakdown and left the event early with permission from my employer, only to later receive a text that the staff photo was overlooked and was taken without me. <laughs> wow. I was excluded, which further alienated me. Wow, dude. You la You want help? Additionally, after this traumatic event, like uh, we got to bend the whole thing because this woman thinks... Or trans? I don't know if she... I don't know. Additionally, after this traumatic event, celeb celebratory messages were shared internationally about how successful the event was, completely dismissing my trauma. Oh, my God. Until I brought these insensitive and hurt truth and hurt hurtful messages to their attention. Okay, there's more. I don't want to read it. If you're bored, go fuck yourself. Racial trauma has tremendously impacted my mental and physical health in ways I never experienced before. That sentence alone can live. You know? I haven't been eating, drinking, or sleeping well. All right. Well, that's my sense of taste and smell change. Oh. Hmm. Even food I used to enjoy smells repulsive. Hmm. What have we found out later? She's pregnant. I have severe neck and shoulder pain that I'm currently treating out of pocket since my extended health coverage through work has been exceed. You have shoulder pain because of a white guy doing hip hop? I have suffered multiple anxiety attacks in public which is why I limited commuting on public transit and I'm using Lyft Uber instead. My ADHD symptoms worsened as my brain feels extremely overwhelmed trying to navigate ways to cope with the trauma, financial burden, and stress. Most of the time, I have extreme fear of leaving my apartment unless I am with my friends. It takes me hours to plan leaving. I'm right with you there, but that's because of my OCD. And a lot of times I get so physically exhausted from thinking and planning, I just give up and don't leave. Okay, well. I recently completed my second MA degree that resulted in me drowning in more debt and student loans. I intend on push publishing my MA thesis, apply for art grants, complete art projects, and more. But following this trauma, I missed every deadline. Is there more? No. Hmm. I expected to... Hmm. I expected to... Is this a parody? 
It's real. Thank you so much for everyone who donated here and for e-transfer me some funds. I haven't posted an update in a bit because I was waiting to hear back some details from my employer. Also, due to my severe PTSD resulting from the racial trauma, I have physical symptoms now every time I think of my workplace gagging, nausea, severe muscle pain. One of the triggers is my GoFundMe, which is why it took me some time to write an update here. Uh, God, see? (sighs) What the fuck? It's like, this is the thing, man. It's hard enough to deal with somebody who has one problem. This person has 10 problems and it is expecting the world to bend to it. We can't do that because there's 7 billion people in the world. Dude, if there were 10 people, this woman was in a class and everyone was like, we don't know what to do with her, just leave. There's 7 people, billion people in this world. If the world changes for you, it's fucked for so many other people. Dude, put one step in front of the other. And I hate being like this, but you push. I'm a centrist, but you got to just get out there, man. I know you're not asking for my advice, but you put it online. Dude, she's got $3,000. She made $3,000 on her GoFundMe. Who's fucking donating? I'm going to donate for real. Oh, what do, what do you what can you What can you say to these people? It's a mental condition, huh? I mean, we all have mental conditions. I have mental conditions. I have OCD. It's hard for me. Dude, something trigger my OCD. Something trigger my PTSD. I don't blame anybody about it. You know, I try not to, I at least try not to right? to get to the point where you're writing a whole, I wish people took like none of this, none of this is her fault, you know? And I don't think you should bully her. This is a comedy podcast. And I feel for this woman, man. I just think that she, you know, people like this might need some help. I don't feel for her because she got racially traumatized. I feel for her because this fucking, she can't sit in a class without finding a problem with it like that. She can't even be at home without finding a problem. This is a real issue. Dude, sometimes my OCD gets the best of me and I stay in my fucking bed for a long time. I don't even think about blaming someone else for that. I mean, yeah, I blame other people for lots of things like fucking, you know. If I forget to bring water up to the bedroom when I'm going to bed, maybe it's because my wife distracted me and that's her fault. But I'm not starting a GoFundMe because of it. Guys, my wife distracted me when I tried to go upstairs. I needed water. I'm dealing with severe trauma in bed because I don't want to go downstairs. I can't leave because she knows I have bad OCD and I already set up for bed. So I'm up here and she wants me to go get water for her. But I was having the water and then I put it down at the bottom of the stairs because she asked me to clean the dishes. And yeah, all the dishes were mine, but I cleaned them up. And then when I went upstairs, I forgot the water. I had the water anyway. I'm trying to get $5,000 because I think that that's what it's worth, that I forgot the water. I woke up parched and my OCD was absolutely flaming. My wife didn't go get it. It resulted in a fucking, uh, you know, a speed bump in my marriage. So it's like, what the fuck do I do? Can people donate? I probably could get some money for that, honestly. I definitely could get some money for that if I was indigenous. I'm from the Sioux tribe, secretly. I think my adopted grandmother is Jewish. No, no bullshit, man. The doctor was Jewish. Um, I think, I don't know. People think shit is crazy. But also, there's so many fucking things that are so crazy out there in the world. I just can't believe it. The internet fucked everything up, didn't it? Crazy, 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 crazy. Crazy, 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 crazy